Hello everybody! Yeah, Mark here from Soulfly Concepts and welcome to the first ever Let's Play that I'm I'm doing now. That's what I'm doing now. I'm playing games. So, um, yeah, this is the Doctor Who The Adventure Games. And let me tell you something, what an adventure it's been trying to get this freaking game. Um, I ended up buying it on Steam. I heard you can get it free, but uh, yeah, so what, I'm a sucker for it. I bought it on Steam. I bought it. Yep, 15 quid, I think it was. 14.99. I don't really care. So, yeah, I've had a quick go on this, and, uh, well, I say we'll just jump straight in. Yep, for those of you who are wondering, Let's Play is going to become a common thing. Um, they're going to be uploaded every Monday. So, Monday is now going to become Let's Play Monday. <laughs> Um, there'll probably be a couple of the Doctor Who ones going up first, and after that, I don't know, I'll have to invest in some more games, I guess. But, yeah, uh, for now, it's Let's Play Doctor Who. For those wondering, I am actually a massive Doctor Who fan. Uh, I'm what the universe now calls a Whovian. That's right, I hoover things up, and uh, my name's Ian. Whovian. Alright, here we go. Nineteen sixty three. Such a good year. I don't think it was the year you bought that outfit then. You know, we can go to see the Beatles play in nineteen sixty three, but the Ice Age is only a click away on the dial. Can I meet John Lennon? No. What? No, you can't. Not Ringo. Why doesn't anybody ever want to meet Ringo? There's no such thing as a sexy drummer. You know, I'd never considered that. Then again, why would I? Nineteen sixty three. Beatles' first two albums, Sean Connery as James Bond, The Kings, The Rolling Stones, Mary Quant, John Steed and Kathy Gale. I don't know who those last three are. Now, out there, London is the coolest place, not just on Earth, but the whole galaxy. Uh, coolest place? Looks like someone fucked no. up a little bit. <laughs> Impossible. Yeah, you fucked up. Did you get this wrong? Yes, he did. Maybe this is like... 2963 or something. There's no mistake, this is 1963. But how? What or, or who could have done this? Something with the power to alter time. On a massive scale. Doctor, look. Human heart! Get down. It's a red pepper pot, run! No, no, no. No, no. Ah, into the time vortex. <clears throat> into the time vortex, Jack. There will be treasure. Or something like that. Matt Smith. Karen Gillan. Yellow. Dr. D.W. Who. City of the Daleks by Phil Ford. Do you like that? My sort of BBC thing going on there. <laughs> We've got to talk to her. Wait. Now we've got to talk to her. Come on. Come along, Pond. Yeah, I get it. Okay. How about walk over here, TARDIS? There's no time to waste, we have to find that woman! Okay, let's find that woman. Oh, it glows! We can find a way to break through this barricade. Okay, there's a car. There's a car up here that's, uh... I don't like the way the taxi is balanced. One wrong move and it could come crashing into us. That woman think? escaped down a manhole, we need to find her. That's nice. Okay. So, give it a push from the other side. Oh, there's Daleks over there. Didn't fucking notice that. Stop! Look out for that Dalek! Maybe we can avoid it if we're careful. You know, it's been... a little bit since I last played this game. And I completely forgot about those Daleks.
Here it comes. Big red pepper pot thing. I'm being followed by pond, right? Yeah, slowly but surely, as you do. I think we're okay. Nice! Give a push. This looks like it could smash through that barrier. Amy, can you give me a hand? Sure. One, two, three! Ooh, dramatic music. Well, not exactly elegant, but it did the job. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> it's dark down there. When I said I wanted to meet the Beatles, I meant the band, not the Bucks. Well, you can stay up here and meet the Daleks. But they're more heavy metal. Be careful down here. You never know what you're going to find on the underground. Rats, dinosaurs, yetis. Yetis? Okay. The woman we saw must be around here somewhere. Don't move! Oh, found her. Ah, there you are. Hello. Hi. Calm down, we're here to help you. How can I trust you? I don't Do know. Do you look like Daleks? Us humans have to stick together. I'm the doctor, by the way. And I'm Amy. Sylvia. Tell me what happened. When did the Daleks get here? What do you mean? How can't you know? They overrun the Earth, the whole planet. We've sort of been away. Promise you, Sylvia, we can help you. Just tell us, please. They came out of the sky, like, like they tore a hole in it. Legions of Daleks flying out of it. So many they turn the sky dark. Yeah, you know what? That many Daleks? I think you should just give up now and thousands go home. Thousands and thousands of them. Thousands. Take the cyanide pills and just leave it. Uh, well, I would ask my audience what what do what do you think I should ask, but I'm just going to go straight for this. And there are no other survivors. Us no. against the Daleks. They destroyed everything. Everyone. There's just me left. Aww. The last human being. That's what the Daleks said. No, that's Cassandra. That, wasn't it? There's you two. Well, one's not human. The other one is beyond your time. Um, hang on. The last human. So where does that leave Cassandra? That really screws up. Um some of the earlier episodes of Doctor Who. How did you survive? Daleks can't do this. The Daleks can't do this. They've never had the power to change time like this before. Change time? <laughs> what are you talking about? Look, I'm barely hanging on to my sanity as it is. Listen to me, Sylvia. This was not supposed to have happened. 1963 was followed by 1964, and a whole lot more years after that. I have to stop whatever the Daleks have done to make this happen. Look, it isn't safe to stay here. If you want to stay alive now, you have to keep on the move. Let me check ahead. These tunnels are dangerous. Yes. Lone woman, go ahead. Check. Bad. Bad noise. That's what that was. Oh look, a red pepper pot. I think it just got even more dangerous. Sylvia is safe. The Daleks can't see her. But we're going to have to be very careful if we're going to get to her. Bloody, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. I really could do with one of these for my birthday, if anyone's interested in buying me one. Got to move quietly but fast. Quiet but fast, quiet but fast, quiet but fast. Faster, 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 slower, slower, faster. Slower. Yeah, because that would stop a Dalek. She's always in such a precarious place. Yeah, see ya. All right, looks like we made it through that one. Now, it's all downhill from here. By which I mean, it probably only gets worse. Stop! The crack is electrified. Then we need to reroute the power somehow and fast. Yes. 
very fast. Oh, look, a glowing box. This is going to take some manual rewiring. I reckon this is one of the massive Doctor Who puzzles that's coming into play now. I think I remember this one. Okay, yes, 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 I do. Oops, there we go. No, I knew I screwed up straight away. I screw up almost instantly. That's just pathetic. Or did I? Yeah, I did. No, I didn't. Oh, well, I, I don't know. Let's just go with it. Yeah, we've got a link to the top. I am God! Now it's safe. We better get a move on before that Dalek spots us. Yes, before the Dalek spots us. You know, not that we've been standing here for about five minutes or anything. Hurry, Doctor. The exit is just there. Dynamite and Sylvia must be setting a booby trap. Ha, huh, booby. Up you go, Amy. I just need to set this trap. Hurry. Sylvia! Exterminate! Run, Doctor, run! Exterminate! No! Oh, she dead. Haha, <laughs> he dead. We killed her. We've got to get back to the TARDIS. It's like the eye for an eye thing, isn't it? Wait, back to the TARDIS. Why do I remember this and not like it? Oh, yeah. Why would you even go that way? The TARDIS isn't that way. The TARDIS is either across that bridge or across this little bridge. I am not that stupid. You know, I say that I'm not that stupid now. But you give me five minutes, and I can guarantee I'll prove myself wrong. Oh, I am good. Doctor. I am very, very Amy. good. It's all right, Amy. You're going to be all right. Yes. I felt so weird. No. It's going to be all right, Amy. I promise you, if I can analyze the time and place that the Daleks altered the timeline. I don't get it. If humanity is destroyed in 1963, how am I still here? The TARDIS protects you. <laughs> Does it we now? We have to act quickly. Gotcha. What is it? The source of the Daleks' time meddling. It's Scaro. The planet of the Daleks. Coordinates set. We're going back to where it all began going to save the human race. Wait, so let me get this right. The only way to save the human race is to go to the planet of the Daleks, or, or Scaro, to fight the Daleks. Well, Doctor Who and the Daleks have been going for quite some time. Um, yeah, okay. It all started on Scaro. I guess it should all end on Scaro. <laughs> but either way you frickin' spin it, Scaro sounds like a bad idea. Oh look! Scaro! It's alright. Nobody home. And they've been busy rebuilding this place too. Rebuilding? Kalan. City of the Daleks. The last time I saw it, it was in ruins and the Daleks had fled. But now Cologne is reborn. Yeah, well, I'm still not coming here for my holidays. Don't blame you. It never stops raining, so I wouldn't go outside. Even with an umbrella, the atmosphere is 30% sulfuric acid. Ooh, no wonder they're so screwed up. Come on. We have to find the source of the Daleks' time manipulation and stop them. Whatever that takes. Okay. 
Let's do it. Door. Door is blocked to a dark internal sensor to get through. If I use the sonic, I may cause an alert. If we can find a Dalek sensor, it should open automatically. Wait a minute. So if he uses the sonic on the door, it may cause an alert. But if he sonics the Dalek head, that's going to be just fine. The Daleks won't sense it because it's not aimed at a wall. Is that how it works? Okay, well, you know, I'm, I'm all for uh, bad writing. Through the maze? Oh, I hate mazes. Alright, so I've got to get this thing out of here. See, that's the reason why I hate mazes. I'm actually fairly decent at them. But when it comes to actually being good at getting through the maze without touching sides like this, yeah, not so much. I can't remember. I think there was like a maze game on Ratchet and Clank or something like that. I think it was like Ratchet and Clank 2. Where you had to sort of work through a maze to get things done. And uh, it was like to open doors or something like that. And I failed at it so much. What usually takes about a week took me about five or six months to complete a game. <coughs> I don't feel right. Steady. Doctor? Oh, she's a ghost. Sorry, Amy, I'm so sorry. What is happening to me? Your dad. Time is catching up with you. Oh, um, what? When the Daleks destroyed humanity in 1963, you became a paradox. Oh, come on, what I you said was exist, better. But you do because the TARDIS protected you. But that protection can only last for so long. That's why we have to find how the Daleks went back in time and put things right. For all of humanity and to save you. But there'll be Daleks everywhere. It doesn't matter. I'll find a way. But first, I have to slow down what's happening to you. The Daleks have temporal technology. I can use that. We need to build a chronon blocker from Dalek spare parts. That will counter the effect of the paradox. We have to find a Dalekanium coil and a control crystal. Uh, like you're talking English? Uh, what? 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 Don't worry. You rest here and I'll find them and bring them back. Okay. So... That door should now open, yeah? Yeah! Okay... Let's try in here. <laughs> okay. The, I, don't, I don't think they're alive, but... Um, yeah. Although that guy over there is very much alive. Come on, Justin, out the way. I said I've given it a name. It's called Justin now. Uh, this is a, it's not a good idea to stop production. Here's a door. Crisis AI. averted. Is it now? Need I remind you, you're still in a Dalek factory. I don't think there's any crisis averted. If you're inside a Dalek factory. Let's have a look around. There is literally nothing to do. Apart from go in here, yeah? Go in here. Uh, typical. Oh, as you can see, I'm controlling this with the mouse, so it's uh, a little bit funky. Yeah, I just need to well, push. Okay. Hump. Hump. Push. <laughs> Climb. Oh, I guess I'm following the production. Yeah, I remember now. I remember. I remember. I remember. Yeah, following the, the endless stream of Dalek pieces going into that room. Nothing. 
to get my head knocked off by a thing. Oh no, we made it, we made it. Ah. Fact. <clears throat> the Red Daleks are drones or workers and are led by the White Supreme Dalek. The Blue Daleks are in charge of strategy. The Orange Daleks are scientists. The purpose of the mysterious yellow internal Dalek is yet unknown. A Dalek is a mutated creature encased in a metal shell. Can I just point out the BBC's grammar mistake right here? Scientists, full stop. And yeah, they got the capital letter right, but there's no space. Silly people. Wait, what's that? A Contron crystal, just what I needed. Fancy that? Fancy a Contron crystal being there. Oh, okay. Dalek transfer in secure means to bypass the security cell. So we can use that, yeah? Oh, right, yeah, yeah. I just read the damn thing. See, I told you I'd sort of fall back on myself with this stupid thing. I'm not that stupid, and looks like I actually am. Alright, so... If I remember rightly, I still need to go this way. Come on, Dave, move out the way. Continue to move, Dave. Narrow escape. <laughs> you shouldn't say Christ is averted this time, because, yeah, you're still in a Dalek factory. I remembered exactly where that was. I'm really proud of myself. I am good at this. Yeah. By the way, I just want to say for the record, Soulfly Concepts is not responsible for any foul language used during this gameplay. I'll get down. Good idea. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I don't trust that. Not one little bit. Come along, Justin. Back to your rounds. There's a good Dalek. In and out like a ninja. I shall round the corner and boom! I'm safe. For now. Alright, let's go fix Amy Pond. Doctor, please hurry. I'm fading away. Don't worry, Amy. I've got all the components I need now. Current unblocking by moving the components through the energy field. Uh, it's going to be another one of the maze things, isn't it? Yes, yes it is. And it's moving faster this time. What joy! Uh, I broke it. Okay. Let's try again. This time, I'm not gonna break it. Okay. That went perfectly fine. Oh dear. That almost didn't go perfectly fine. I am invincible! Oh. How's that? A bit better. Amy's back. Hmm. At least I've got some colour back. See through is so not you. Uh, it will block the chronon energies for a while, but we have to reach the Supreme Council chamber and deactivate whatever is in there. But how do we even find out what's in there? It could be a Dalek convention inside. Ah, we can see into it from the Dalek's visualizer room. Come on. So, I've now got to go to the visualizer room. Which I believe is in the opposite direction to the way I went before. I was right.
Wait a minute, I remember this. Be careful. Running. Aha. Here we are. This is where they monitor and record all Dalek activity across the universe. This is, is like the Dalek Records Office. Okay, fantastic. A librarian Dalek. That's something I actually want to see. If I'm not There's mistaken. Your librarian. Yeah, I thought so. Visualizer eye. That's... And you know what Stickler's librarians are? Uh. We need to get to the console so I can deactivate the security beam. Those databanks look like good cover. Let's go. Well, the one at the far end first looks like an easy target. So I'm going to go for that one. You know something? Last time I played this game, I went for the one at the other end of the room first. And that was just a stupid thing to do. Okay, I had a bit of a junk cut there. I had a phone call. Anyway, let's 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 go for this. Sonic. Shibidi ba doo, dibi dibi doo 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 doo. Click on the Dalek symbols. Okay. Oh yeah, it's like Tetris. I remember this now. Uh. Yeah. There we go. If you're really lucky, you might actually see me screw this up completely. Maybe not this one, but the next one possibly. There's a good chance of it. Like a really, really good chance of it. Like a really weird shape Y. Oh, crap. Nearly. Nearly. <laughs> Remember how I said you won't see me screw this one up? You nearly did. Well, that was easy. Brilliant. The security beam is narrowed. Okay. You better be careful, though. The rate of its scan sweep has speeded up. Alright, cool. I don't like it. <laughs> That's way too close for comfort, that is. I really don't like how close that is. I am not chancing it. I'm going to wait, wait for it to go back the other way. Okay, it's going back the other way. So we will too. Oh, I think you know when Amy turns up, I move slightly further forward. Okay. Right. Now the second one, if I'm not mistaken, slightly more tricky. So, let's do it. Notice the concentration, I've gone quiet. When I go quiet, bad things normally happen. That one. Okay. Alright, excellent. I'm invincible, I am God. Bow down. I am game lord. Just want to go now. That beam is moving pretty fast. Oh, no kidding. Okay. So I think we'll wait for it to complete another sweep. Excellent. Let's go. It's coming back. Going. 
Sonic at the ready. Yeah, same thing. Alright, fantastic. Buzz like your ship. There we go. Um, that one? Yep, cool, 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 cool. Oh crap, that one. That one! <laughs> I nearly died. <laughs> right. Let's see what we can see, shall we? Yes. Aha! That's the Supreme Council Chamber, all right. There's the Emperor. He is massive. Occupational hazard. You're sitting on a throne all the time, you're going to put on a few pounds. But that is what I'm interested in. Is that it? Whatever the Daleks used to wipe out the Earth. Well, if I was a betting man, yeah, that'd be it. That's interesting. Temporal coordinates. Interesting to you, maybe, but how do we get anywhere near that thing with all those Daleks around? Knock politely. Uh, what? Knock politely, he said. Knock politely. Okay, I shall knock politely. We need to be careful. Uh-huh. Against the wall, please. <laughs> I bet a lot of people have wanted, that, uh, wanted to say that to Amy Pond. Come on, Daleks. We piss, we piss, we piss, we piss, we piss, we run! I think we're okay. Fantastic! Wait a minute. I am back in the production area, aren't I? That is completely fucked up. Right, let's get in the lift. Where to now? Straight to the top. The Supreme Council Chamber. It's like it read my mind. Dalek technology. Wonderful. If only they didn't want to use it to kill everybody all the time. Taken to the Dalek Emperor! Oh dear. For a stroke of luck. Just the dictator I wanted to see. Speak for yourself. You will come with us! Must I? By all means. Lead on. Well, I guess the doctor's taken this one into his own hands, so yeah, by all means, lead on! Recognize me then. I should save time. Okay. You have to stop. That sounds like something the doctor would say. You have to stop. The laws of time can't be manipulated on such a massive scale. The laws of time are controlled by the Daleks. No, they're too powerful for anyone to control. You carry on ignoring them and time will fold in on itself. Like you will destroy the Daleks and everything else. Risk from disruption. Have you got the first idea of what will happen if you carry on disrupting the time continuum? Daleks will be the masters of time and the universe! Oh, good. Show me the source? So, what's that, like, like, like the splendid source from Family Guy? The source of all dirty jokes ever? Show me the source of your power. Oh, source the of power. The Emperor Dalek does not obey orders! Well, one left. What use is power if there's no one to marvel at it? To quake with fear? Come on, show me. Scare me. Witness the might of the Daleks! Fear it! No. It 
can't be. What is it? The Eye of Time. More powerful than the heart of any TARDIS, more than the power of every TARDIS ever built. Harnessed by the Time Lord centuries ago and lost at the fall of Gallifrey. Lost? The Eye is a natural phenomenon. Some say it is the heart of time and space itself, the very core of the Big Bang. Time Lords contained it in a powerful iron field, but when Gallifrey was destroyed, it vanished into the universe. The oh. Daleks found it! It is ours! Ah. Daleks are the new Time Lords! Time Lords choose their powers so, finders keepers the then. <laughs> to crush it. You were weak. Soon, throughout all time and space, there will be only Daleks! No. Your time just ran out. Uh, Amy, run. Exterminate! Not gonna lie, I don't think they managed to actually exterminate the Doctor. I think it's because they were con constantly shouting exterminate instead of actually shooting. Oh my god, Dalek's biggest downfall. They tell you what they're gonna do before they do it. You have time to dodge. Makes sense. I'm gonna get a drink. Nom nom. Or for those wondering, um, I'm drinking Rockstar X Durant. Uh, the blue one. It's the blueberry and pomegranate. <laughs> well, at least I land on my ass. Are you alright? Yes. What happened? Those temporal coordinates, remember? This is Kalan, just before the Daleks returned to it with the Eye of Time. But it looks like it will be coming soon. And it won't be long before the Emperor sends more Daleks after us through the Eye. I remember. What do we do? Set a trap. I remember how to set a trap. I know how to do this one. I know how to do it. I know how to do it. I know how to do it first. You need this cable. It's made out of Dalekanium, you know. You know, I once had a cake made out of Dalekanium. Or was it carrots? Either way, it was horrible. Okay, and then we need to come up to here. We need to go into inventory like that, you see. And then press on that. These wires should connect the debris to the generators and with a zap of the sonic. We should have our trap set. Keywords being shown. Then all we'll need is a Dalek. Or two. Okay. And now I need to zap the machine with my sonic screwdriver after bumping flirtatiously into Amy. Yep. Sonic. Doctor, it's happening again. We've jumped time again. The chronon blocker won't work here. Just hold on, Amy. I can save you, I promise. Oh, here comes the Daleks. And there they go. Stay Good. with me, Amy. I'm... I'm okay. Come on. We have to be ready for them. I just love it when girls say that, I'm okay, I'm okay. They don't really mean it. She'd be much better saying, I'm fine. Oh dear. This way then. Stop. Okay. That's a Varga plant over there. These vines have a deadly sting. To get past, we'll have to time it carefully. Why are there Varga plants on Skyro? I thought Daleks didn't like any other life forms. And it's down here, isn't it? Oh dear, I went straight past, straight past, straight past. Yeah, I remember what happened last time. Yeah, last time I did this, I, I remember this very, very clearly. Last time I did this, Amy ended up getting herself killed because she's silly.
This should do the trick. Secure Kalan. Prepare to activate the Eye of Time. The Supreme Dalek. Who else? What are we going to do? We have to release the Eye before the Daleks activate it. Then the natural timeline will be restored. The Daleks don't crash Earth and Amy Pong is born. Ah, uh, that's great. But how are we going to get past that lot? Well, like I wouldn't have a plan. You don't have a plan. Everything we need is in here. This is linked to the eye of every Dalek. If I can reverse engineer it, we can interfere with their vision. We just right. need some parts from the production facility. Oh, I think I know what's coming. Could you pop next door and rustle me up a couple of things while I get started on this gizmo? Hang on a minute. Didn't he say everything what you needed in here? A cup of tea, chalky bickies. Oh, yes, but... A Dalek gun and a Dalek eye stalk. I recommend looking for salvage rather than a live one. Yeah, you're so funny. Good luck. Let me open this door for you. I could have sworn he said everything we need is in here. But yeah, no, yeah, you're sending a fading girl off into the never-ending darkness and oh, oh god for that, I thought I was gonna be killed. Didn't see me. Looks like invisibility can have its advantages. Saw the cut screen border appear and I was just like, oh no! I walked straight into a trap. I better stay low. Okay. Shit. It's alright. It's okay. It's cool. It's cool. That? Not so much. Perfect, an eye stalk. It had better not be too damaged. So negative. Get your tongue off the ground, that's disgusting. You don't know where it's been. Come on, click it. I hate you. Ah, shiza. <laughs> Oh god. I'm about to be seen, aren't I? No, 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 it's good. It's all good. <laughs> I'm sure Daleks aren't actually that stupid. Then again, I've been wrong before. Well, that door looks a bit blocked now, so yep, this way, this way, I remember now. Okay. Right here. Press the thing. Hope it still works. <laughs> Time to get out of here. Okay. I ain't trusting that right now. I'm not a trusting person. Hiding, running. Oh, that wasn't timed too badly at all. Now all I've got to do is get through this lot. Hey George. He's called George now. Hey, I made it back. Brilliant. 
You found both of them. Yes, I Let's did. Get to work. Oh, it's another maze. Oh man. Thought I already proved that I'm not very good at these. You see what I mean? Life isn't fair. Okay. Good lord. Two. I actually counted rather early there. I didn't want to do that. Because no more like it had come back to haunt me. Which is why I'm not going to be saying three for quite some time. Three. Can I just say? Aren't I great? I am brilliant. There. This will blind the Daleks. Well, at least it's... But its range is limited. Uh, Unless I can fit it into the cradle of the old Emperor. That would take a different Dalek door. in the chamber. Doctor, I feel so strange. I'm sorry, Amy. We're running out of time. We can do this. But it has to be now. Open the eye. It's now or never. There's too many of them, Doctor. They'll exterminate you on sight. Give it to me. I can do this. You have to let me. Okay. Invisible Amy to the invisible rescue. Oh no. That's bad. Okay. It's cool. I made it. I am... Brilliant. That's a really long way up. This had better work, Doctor. Now, I've got to destroy those magnetic field generators to free the eye. Sweet. Exterminate! Oh, God. Why does this remind me of Devil May Cry? Okay, okay, okay. I get it, I get it, I get it. Exterminate! Yeah, I'm not gonna get through that crossfire. Yeah, I'm not gonna get through that one either. Gotta go around this guy. Exterminate. 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 I cannot see. Oh god, now I've gotta get to Amy. My vision is impaired. I don't remember this bit. My vision is impaired. I always thought it was the other way. I'm gonna get killed, aren't I? My vision is impaired. Yes I am! <laughs> I've got to go again. I've got to go again. Exterminate! Exterminate! I cannot see! Okay, round you. Exterminate! Go up this way! I cannot see! I think this was the correct way to go. The <laughs> other way? Not see. so much. Amy? Doctor? I made it! Now that's why I call door to door. <laughs> He's funny, steady, door to door. Steady, take it easy. I'm okay. We did it! <laughs> <laughs> of course we did it, look. This is Kalan as it should be. Ruined. But how did we get here? The eye just spat us back to the point where we entered it. And Earth? Yeah, that's a really good question though. How did they get there? I thought Skyro was time locked. Uh, whatever. Mum, stop being such a square, will you? Yeah, Mum. It's only ten o'clock. I 
I look after myself, you know. It's almost quite early. Kind of close. It's not the end of the world. It's not only 10 o'clock. Now, didn't you say something about meeting Ringo Starr? I don't think she did, actually. 